Hey guys, I'm Evil Mastery, and I will be the tester for West Kai in Season 6 and the off season. So, you guys are actually my first video, and I've already messed it up. I actually recorded this, and my mic was dying, because I have a wireless headset, and it died. So, I didn't know, and I recorded this. So, I was kind of debating, should I do, like, post-commentary, or just redo the whole entire video? I decided that... You know what, just gonna do post com commentary. This will be my only one after this. All of them will be, you know, live with the video, but this one will be post commentary. I apologize, I will try to uh, be more professional. This is my first time, so please forgive me. So, yes, I am Evil Master, I will be the tester for you. Um, if you're wondering, I am on Team Boo. We are in the same division, of course, Sans. And, uh, you know, don't worry, I I'm, you know, I'm don't have it out for you guys or anything like that. Uh, before, you know, you know, the booze do good, do well, or, you know, we go ahead and set the, you know, the, how the division's gonna play out in Season 6. I just want everybody and West Kai to do great. Definitely, I want you know, all of us to be able to move up to North Kai, and then I can be the tester for North Kai in Season 7. <laughs> so, um, I can see where you're testing here. Uh, it's cool that you might be getting uh, access to Raditz. Um, I already know how this fight's gonna turn out, and um, I must say, it's a little spoiler alert, uh, Raditz was fairly impressive. Uh, Tartless has a fruit addiction. <laughs> um, um, overall, I think that uh, Raditz is a better character, as you can clearly see. Fruit addiction, and gets b 2 in the face. <laughs> um, you know, it's pretty much choosing between a, a fruit addiction and just Raditz. He even has a B1 that puts him at uh, max power, so... You know, that, that can definitely be something that you might want to consider. Um, if you guys are wondering, I am a pretty big fan of Team Sand. You know, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a big fan of the Bardock. I think that he is just so badass. And uh, it's just cool that we're in the same division this season. So I am looking forward to doing a lot of testing for you guys. I want you guys to do really well, you know. Uh, like I said, it's not about, you know who's the top of the divisions, who's at the bottom of the divisions that I'm concerned with. It's uh, that we all do very well that, you know, despite, of course, someone has to be at the top division and someone has to be at the bottom. Got off the fruit addiction this time, but due to him, you know, with that fruit addiction, he clearly allowed Raditz to go into max power. He went to max power himself, but, you know, was it worth it is the question. And then, all of a sudden, you know, Toros gets a little bit of pep in his step, starts kicking that butt, but... So I'm going to try to get your test videos up to you guys as soon as possible. Uh, I am a YouTuber and I, you know, I upload a lot of videos. Oh, he's a president. Oh, does the kill diver counter and oh, does again. And all he does is just kick him and he's done. So, of course, we're going to go ahead and do best two out of three. So, as you can clearly see, right? So it's fairly impressive. So, I'm fairly busy on my YouTube channel. I upload five videos a day on my channel, so I'm fairly diligent, but of course I'm going to have time to upload test videos for you guys. Uh, I'm going to even go to the extreme. I'm going to create everybody their own playlist. So, Sans get a playlist, Boos get a playlist, Ginyus get a playlist, and Blades get a playlist. And uh, you can always just go to my channel, go to that playlist, and there will be all your videos. There will be names so you know exactly what you're looking at. Uh, you know. I'm not, I'm not DMZ, but I'm definitely trying my best for you guys. But I, I just apologize for this video right here. So, Torres pulled out a pretty nice combo. He's about a half a bar ahead. Like I said, I already know the outcome of this fight, so... Uh, but I'm just really impressed with, uh, with Raditz. I mean, uh, as of the recording of this video, I have not done your, uh, your Raditz versus Nappa video yet, so... Uh, I'm just gonna see how impressive he will be against Nappa, and then maybe you guys can uh, start considering if you want to put on, uh, on Raditz on the team. So, I can't remember if it was Season Five or see, I know there was one season that uh, that Raditz was on Team Derp. Uh, I apologize, I don't know. Uh, I got into Dragon Ball Z League. I wouldn't say fairly recently, but you know, recently or -er, I got I jumped in like right in the middle of season five, so I watched all the way up through season five, caught up. Then I watched seasons one, two, three, and four. So season five has been kind of a blur to me. So I really can't remember what season Raditz was on Team Derp, but I know he was on Team Derp at one point, so uh, for you to be able to get access to him would be great. So, one of the things that you might want to also consider about uh, Raditz that's actually pretty cool is that when he did his B1, he kind of had kind of like a, a, a stance effect, kind of like a, what was it called, power body, you know, where he's not phased by punches and stuff, so, uh, you know, 
Might want to consider that when choosing him. Alright, he's at max power. And Tarlis' B1 is so widespread, it's like a trap shooter. No, oh, wow. The kill driver is nice, but yeah. Uh Rabbit has uh, that top class warrior rush uh B B two. So like I said, they're both down the last bar, but Turles pretty much just pulls it out with that B two. So uh top class warrior blocks it, but then he oh he is stunned though. But uh, I believe that uh, Raditz uh, doesn't do enough damage to uh, win, and we actually go to round three. So, I apologize, like I said, I apologize for the unprofessionalism. Like I said, this is my first video, so uh, please forgive me. So, you know, went up the max power, couldn't do anything, just got punched in the face. So, we go ahead and go on to round three. So, I will be sure to uh, make sure that my headset is nice and charged for you guys. I didn't know, like... Uh, Pretty much, I, you know, the Tenkaichi Ball ended, uh, and then all of a sudden DMZ contacted me, and then everybody, like, three out of the four teams, uh, you, the Booze, and Ginyu were all like, we want tests, and I was like, I'm gonna get on it right now, so I was like, oh, I'm gonna get on it, and be on the ball, and then I recorded the video, and then I was like, oh, headset dead, and then I had to wait till next day, so, um, I apologize for this being, you know, uh, probably a day later than you're anticipating. I'm trying to get it to you as soon as possible. You know, the faster you get your test, the faster you can continue working and, you know, requesting more tests and, you know, we can make this West kind of vision the next North kind of vision. <laughs> you can clearly see, uh, he's about a bar behind that really widespread B2 that Turles has, you know. I think you're probably going for the kill driver, but you can't guarantee that the computer will do the kill driver. Top class warrior. Hit him in the back of the head for 7k damage. Oh, I mean, he's, he's juggling them pretty well. Up, uh, free detection. Nope, doesn't get it off. And gets his butt kicked for it and gets punished. He has n neither of them have any energy right now. They're like, no, we don't need to charge up. We're just, we're just gonna fifty cuff it out. I'm like, nope. Nice melee combo from Raditz. And then there you go. That's the right up there. So while Toyos is having his fruit addiction and you know getting his butt kicked for eating it, uh, Raditz clearly has pulled off a nice B1 to put him at max power. Nice melee combo. And uh, has pretty much just slapped the crap out of a. Uh, out of Turles right there. That was a beautiful combo. So, I hope that this test video was useful. I will try to get your Nappa versus Reddit video as soon as possible. So, I apologize for the post commentary, but I hope you guys enjoyed and uh, thank you for uh, having me as a tester. Thanks for watching.